Houston? I th- I think um I think Vanley uh, called called me out. I th- on Throwback Thursday, sometimes he uh, posts a picture or a video of him knocking me out, and, and you know how instigators are, people are tagging me into it, then I see it, and then so I got to post something, a, a picture or a video of me knocking him out, and and went back and forth for, like that for a while, and then he just called me out on Instagram, I believe, that's how I saw it, then uh, he's in Bellator, I'm in Bellator, it's a no-brainer. Um, you were the- twice, I only beat him once, you know, to, I owe him. Um, two more ass women to be one up on them, right? But I know, like a fifth fight, probably be unheard of. But I would be happy with just even the score, because uh, I think the last time we fought, I think I beat him better than the, uh, you know, than the way he beat me twice. Like that was fast, first round. I don't know, it was like a minute or so. I can't remember. But the, you know, the first fight it took a while for him to finish me, and I just fought took 45 minutes uh, prior. In the second fight, I can't remember when to the second round or something like that. Last fight, Chill Sun. I have not been impressed with his performance. I'm gonna fight him. So I, I doubt that he'll sign to fight me a fifth time. Uh, I can't stand Battle He's an asshole. You clearly, clearly see him. him calling me fat, putting his finger in my face. I'm like, come on. Shout out to Rampage Jackson, man. He keeps it all the way a buck. Listen, that was as blunt as the interview is going to get. Um, Rampage wants revenge, but not, you know, the classic Rampage, a more refined, older gentleman Rampage. Um, honestly speaking, I think Quentin Rampage Jackson is going to beat Vandalay Silva. And I like watching Vandalay Silva fights, man. That guy is, his fights are never boring. Come win, lose, or draw. His fights are always action-packed, man. Vandalay is the truth. But I don't think, I don't think that uh, Vandalay in this day and age can beat Queen Rampage Jackson, despite the fact that they both come from pride. So, you know, the steroid allegations, you can make them all day, all night. Doesn't matter. Listen, man, um, honestly speaking, Vandalay versus Quinn, I'm betting on Quinn, man, um, mainly because he's at the max of heavyweight, like, he's 260 right now, he is 260 flat, he might even have to cut weight just to make the heavyweight limit, um, and we all saw how Quinn... Knocked out Vandalay, uh in the UFC. Now imagine that same dude with more mass on him versus Vandalay. Doesn't it doesn't add up, right? I can't wait to see that fight, and um, I don't I, I don't see Vandalay winning. I really don't, man. I think he's been through the ringer. Remember, Vandalay has a record that's similar to Alistair Overeem, despite. Uh, despite Overeem's, you know, appearances in kickboxing and all of that, Vandalay has a record very similar similar to his, you know, win to loss ratio and total amount of fights produced and all. Right? I don't think that he still has it in him anymore. I think all of those legal battles with USADA and then the UFC. Uh, no, no, it wasn't USADA. It was the Nevada State Athletic Commission, right? When they banned him. I think all of that has taken a toll on him and he just wants to get out. Honestly speaking, that's how I feel, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe, and I am out. And I peep you, and I lost respect for you when you say you about this culture and this music, because you ain't. The day you feel you can question me, being where you're from, Chevy Chase, Maryland, graduated in 98, you ain't got no word in this city, it's my city. Any of you radio personalities think you want smoke? Call me Mr. Chimney. I want smoke. 
You know why? Because you can never, you don't work hard as me, bro. You're a sidekick in this city. Sidekick in the morning. Sidekick on your own show. On Complex, you look like a sidekick. Tell Complex to cut me a check tomorrow. Because I made you mad at the night. I'm going to get you some numbers that show is trash on Complex. You're about the culture, but you bring up that ding dong chick to interview. Who you think? We stupid? You think I'm stupid? <laughs>